Yeah, we said that about um, this stage of the season and making sure we got the results and it was a positive one. So, um, you know, everyone's worked incredibly hard today with the substitutes coming on and, and obviously the starters as well. So really pleased for the players. Uh, they stuck to their tests and we've got the positive results, so we're happy. Yeah, we're well, looking at it at this stage of the season. There's also nerves going to come into this as well, isn't it? And uh, it's so tight at the top that, that, that nobody can afford really to have a I think um, it's what's in our control. We can only control the controllables, um, and as long as our attitude's right, we do the right things. We carry out the manager's game plan. Um, everyone sticks to their tasks. There's no problems whatsoever. So we're just taking each game as it comes. Um, thoughts turn straight away to the next one, which is Tuesday night. So we're prepared for that, and uh, obviously professional performance today from all of the players, and uh, everyone's very pleased. Typical conditions as well, wasn't it? The pitch wasn't exactly conducive to playing good football. Wasn't it? I mean, you know, we, 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 whatever the surface is, it, it, it makes no odds to us. Um, and I think Gloucester, the, the same, you know, both try and play football. Um, but whatever it is, we've got to go out and try and get a result. So that wasn't really in our focus today. It was more about what we did, how we did it. And uh, if, we, if we carried out to, to uh, our capabilities, we, we thought we'd get a positive result and we have done. Yeah, the goal's taken well, weren't they? Joe Ironside proving his with him at 4 in 3 and Daniel Antigua getting his first goal for the club. Yeah, I'm pleased with them and, and as Daniel just said, it, it, you know, as, as long as we're scoring goals, um, this group of players, um, it, you know, it doesn't really matter, they just want positive results and making sure that um, whoever gets on the score sheet is contributing to the team as well. So you can see that they uh, are training and uh, um, obviously, uh, you know, pleased for, for Joe and Dan, but it's more important that we get the results. So. You've got a steady bridge on Tuesday against uh, one of uh, Harry's former managers, Steve Burns, just today. Uh, worked, worked a little bit of magic, but going to victory over five. Yeah, it's going to be a tough game. Um, steady bridge um, up, up, up there, obviously, they're, uh, they're fighting for their lives as well. So we, we, we know it's going to be a tough one, but we prepare as we normally do. We'll get ourselves ready uh, and we'll be ready to go for the game. Yeah, no, uh, not Lee Tyler and no Arthur Gunnar today. Darren Wright's to turn away coming in and uh, doing a sterling job. How many times, as, as the gaffer said, it's about the squad and it's about the group, and that's why we do what we do uh, and keep everyone ready. And when they get their chance, they've got to come in and take it. But you know, it's such a good group that everyone's prepared to work for each other. So whoever's out there in the starting positions, uh, there's a lot of good work from everyone because we know we've, uh, you know, we're at that stage of the season where we've got to make sure we get results.